Hey everyone, here's a question from exercise 11.4, fourth question of perimeter and era chapter of class 7. The question is, a veranda of width 2.25 meter is constructed all along outside a room which is 5.5 meter long and 4 meter wide. Fine, we have a two questions here. The first one is the area of the veranda and second one is we have to find the cost if the rate is 200 rupees per meter square. Now in the figure you can see the yellow color portion what is given is a room where the length they have given is 5.5 meter and the width is 4 meter and you can see the blue color portion which is a veranda of a width 2.25 meter is constructed around it. Now we have to find out first the area of the veranda means we have to find out this blue color portion given in the figure. How to find out that? So it's very simple. First we're going to find out the area of the room along with the veranda means this entire thing we're going to find out the area of the whole thing right from this area we will going to remove the area of the room means this portion we're going to subtract then we're going to get the area of the veranda but we don't know the measurements of the entire uh, area that is we don't know the air uh, the length and breadth of the this whole thing that is including the room and the veranda how to calculate that now you can see that in the figure in the question also they have given for the room dimensions they have given they have given the dimension of the veranda now since the length and breadth are 5.5 and 4 we can add 2.25 on both the side means suppose the width here given is 4 meter now this veranda is 2.25 right 2.25 and here also this width will be 2.25 so we're going to add 4 plus 2.25 plus 2.25 which will going to give us 8.5 meter. So this whole length will be 8.5 meter. I hope it's understood how we got it. Now similarly suppose I want to find out the length. Now since we know this length of the room is 5.5 meter we have to add 2.25 on the left side and on the right side both. So when you add this, we'll get the answer as 10 meter. So the length of the room along with the veranda will be 10 meter. Now we got the length and breadth of the room and the room along with the veranda. Now we're going to find the area of both the things separately and then we're going to subtract. So let's start this. So what is given? First we're going to find out the area of the room. So the length, I'm talking about the room first. So this is about the room. For the room, the length is 5.5 meter and the breadth is 4 meter long. Since the shape is in a form of a rectangle, the area will be length into breadth. Right? So length into breadth is 5.5 multiplied by 4. So when you multiply this two number, we will get 22 meter square. Now let us talk about the room and or room including the veranda. So this is a room along with veranda will be. So for this case the length we have calculated will be 10 meter and the breadth will be 8.5 meter. Now we're going to find the area. So area is equal to length into breadth. So this is 10 meter multiplied by 8.5 meter. So this is equal to 85 meter square. Now we have to find out the area of the veranda which means from the area of the room along with the veranda that is the whole thing from this whole we have to subtract this area of the room. Then we are going to get the area of the veranda. So from here we can write down so area of veranda will be equal to 85 meter square that is the area of the whole thing room and veranda. From here we are going to subtract the area of the room which is 22 meter square. So when you subtract these two numbers we will get 63 so 63 meter square. This is the area of the veranda. So we got the answer for the first question. In the second question they are asking us to find the cost if 
per meter square the charging 200 rupees for cementing the veranda if per meter square is 200 rupees what will be the total cost now since we got the area of the veranda we're going to use this now this is second one so in second one the cost is cost this is per meter square per meter square is rupees 200 for cementing then total cost will be total cost will be now since we got 63 meter square right so for 1 meter square the rupees is 200 so for 63 meter square we have to just multiply with 200 63 and 200 will get the exact answer the correct answer so for that total cost will be a total cost for 63 meter square will be equal to rupees 200 multiplied by 63 so when you multiply these two numbers we'll get the answer as rupees 12,600 so this is the answer for the second question I hope this question is clear how we have done in case you have any further question or doubt you can drop a comment below thank you so much for watching